Building new with Caitlin and Kyle. Brought to you by Eastbrook Homes. Anyone who's ever built a new home knows the choices can feel overwhelming. Lucky for our home buyers, Caitlin and Kyle, like all Eastbrook customers, have access to a team of professionals here at Eastbrook's Home Creation Studio. Kyle, congratulations Thank on your new you. home. I'm so excited Thank for you guys. We're excited to be here. Yes. This 4,000 square foot studio is a chance for Caitlin and Kyle Searsiga to create a home that truly reflects who they are. They decided to go with the Fitzgerald Four Plan, a spacious ranch with plenty of room to grow in Rockford's Autumn Trails. Now, designer Amanda Smith skillfully guides them along to ensure their choices for the home work. We can really help inform you on how the products will work in your home, and we can also recommend the right products for your lifestyle as well. Their tour starts in the kitchen where Amanda has laid out some potential selections based on Caitlin and Kyle's homework. We really encourage everyone to prepare for the meeting. We want you to think about what you want your home to look like, what works for you currently, what doesn't work for you, what can we change to make this home perfect. So we have a couple different tools. We have the website that you can get a lot of inspiration from, and then we also have a design software where we have every single product piece that's in our studio where you get to look at that ahead of time. I know some really great options would be our Hancock cabinets, which are showcased here. They do come in white, because I know you're thinking more of a white, brighter kitchen, but I thought it would be awesome to even just add a little bit of contrast with a darker island. I really love this combination. I feel like the trends are going more towards warm tones, yes. yep. which I really love in the island. Mm -hmm. um, and I do love the contrast between the, the white, which I think is a timeless look and hopefully, you know, is popular like years down the line and yeah. then also something like a fun color in the, in the island. Yeah. Other choices include countertops, the tile backsplash, and an assortment of cabinets to optimize storage and efficiency. I also love the drawers yes. um, for organization. I just feel like so much easier to access a drawer than bending over yes. to pull the cabinets out. Mm -hmm. I would suggest incorporating drawers and standard base cabinets, and you're gonna have everything that you would need. So all of our cabinet style options are showcased on this wall here. So we could do something in more of a modern um, palette here, something a little bit more traditional. Based on everything that you had written, I thought the Hancock door style would be perfect. Because it's, like it's got the clean lines, um, and two, it comes in different paint color options. From the kitchen, they moved on to the main floor living space with decisions about the fireplace, mantle, and built-ins. So this gives you a great visual of what those built-ins would look like on either side of your fireplace. Sure. This stone is a little much for mm -hmm. me, so I do think the tile yes. insert option would be great to go with. Yes, tile is an amazing option and then we can talk through the different mantle styles that we have available because you get a choice in that mm -hmm. and then we can talk through colors and everything as well. Next was flooring. Caitlin and Kyle plan to use the same luxury vinyl plank throughout the main floor to give the home an open look and feel. Downstairs going with roll vinyl gave them lots of options. Colors. So we could do something with a little bit more of a hexagon, or if we want to do something bold, um, we could do something with a little bit more of a pattern. Sure. And we have um, more subtle options, so something that just has a subtle texture to it, but made to look more like a tile. For the exterior of the house, Caitlin and Kyle wanted a darker siding with white trim and beautiful gray tones in the stonework. I like this lower stone down here. I yeah. think I like the grays and the stone over the tans, mm -hmm. but I kind of like how it still has the dark that you had mentioned. Yeah, that looks really nice. I love that. Their last stop required a decision about trim and more details on the fireplace. I think I, I um, like the traditional looking fireplace a little bit more. Yeah. And finally, decisions made. It is done. Thank I'm so, so excited much. for you guys. Yeah, we're we're really excited. Yes. Can't wait to see it all come to life. Up next, it's time to get this party started. Let's dig a hole and pour that foundation as we continue building new with Caitlin and Kyle. <laughs> 